Absolutely. Well, let's just talk about Control Yours. Kind of take me through the journey of kind of how this all started. Um, sure. You know, if you, I guess, as far back as you want to go and just bring us up to the day, kind of yeah. uh, the story for, for your sure. small business. Yeah. Well, when I was seven years old now. <laughs> uh, okay. So, yeah. So, I... Um, I, I kind of, it, it, it sort of all just came came to pass. I don't know. I mean, I, you know, I know you're probably thinking, okay, well, would you do things differently? I, I kind of jumped into it with both feet. I, I was working at the Buckle in their web systems department um, before I started Control Yours. And so that's what kind of got me a little bit acclimated to what technology can do. And they were kind of in the, okay, this, I mean, this is a long time ago, probably almost, you know, let's see, almost 20 years ago now. Okay. But, they were just bringing Buckle.com in-house. Okay. So they had a company out in California manage it, and so they were just putting a team together to kind of you know, um, do that more in-house. Um, and so I worked on that team there. I got an internship. I really was not the smartest guy in the room. I shouldn't have probably been there, but <laughs> I, I learned a lot there. Um, right out of college? Uh, this was, I never actually completed college, okay. but um, it was, yeah, kind of in an in-between there. Okay. Um, and, I, well, I learned I learned the possibilities of technology and especially the web, but then I think I also learned, and nothing against the buckle because I think they're a great company, but I also learned that the corporate environment was just not really for me. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, and I've always kind of been an entrepreneur, um, but yeah, I ended up with a partner, started to control yours, and we just kind of, I mean, you know, we were pretty naive, at least I, well, I should speak for myself, yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we just jumped right into it. And I was in a place in my life, too, where I didn't, you know, uh, thankfully with this type of a business, there's not like a ton of overhead or, you sure. know, some businesses, I mean, you've got to have all your ducks in a row before right. you, you know. Um, but I really kind of just bootstrapped and kind of went in little by little. Got it. Yeah. So when you started at the Buckle, did you have an interest in web design and things like that? Or was it just kind of an internship where you were feeling it out to see if you even liked that? Yeah. That well, I was I was actually working nights at a gas station, and my my mom did not like that so much, and so she and actually, yeah. Long story short, um, you know, they were just putting this team together, and the the gentleman at the time that was starting that team went to our church, and so we had him over for lunch, and I think my mom was basically pleading with him, like, is there anything that you can give my son to get him out of this gas station? Sure. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Whatever works. And it, yeah, yep. Praise God, it it was a good good thing for me. Very cool. Yeah. So what year did you start Control Yours? Uh, let's see. It was 2007. Okay. So. So you've been at it 14 years? Yep. It'd be 14 years in yeah, June. So did you start in this location? Did you start somewhere else? No, no. We, no, we, uh, well, just started kind of out of my apartment. We didn't have an office space or anything like that. And, okay. Um, kind of did that for the first few years. And then we actually... Um, Worked in the basement of baristas for okay. a while, uh -huh. which worked out well because I could just walk upstairs and have meetings with people and drink yeah. coffee. <laughs> yeah. um, and then, yeah, we moved into this space um, here on, on Railroad Street uh, maybe eight years ago now, seven or eight years. Okay. So, Very cool. Yeah.